Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am your host Zoe Walshers and today I almost completely forgot to film a video. So recently over this weekend I've been doing a lot more advertising for you know like my socials and stuff and things like that. Like I've been posting a lot more on TikTok. Go check out my TikTok at Zoe with two O's and two E's Walters um to have a look at those i've also been, also been posting on my depop i've been posting on my instagram a lot more so i've just really been trying to you know keep active on social media so in the midst of all this i kind of forgot to like film a youtube video so sorry about my phone in the background but i decided that i'll do a room tour because i haven't yet room tour time Hell yeah, let's just dive into the video. Um, just before I kind of start showing my room, uh, to like categorize it as an aesthetic, I would want to say it's kind of like got that indie aesthetic. That's what I was not really trying to do. I was just trying to make my room as colorful and fun as I could like mixing fun colors and patterns and stuff like that so i'm just gonna say that it's kind of indie but it's more just like funky patterns clothes colorfulness that's the aesthetic of this room okay so you guys have probably already seen parts of this room not gonna lie um, but I'm going to start over in this corner by this window where I kind of call this like the teddy bear section and just random stuff. So I have these two teddy bears. I've had that since I was like a little baby and that is more recent. It's a pig though, so don't be fooled. Then I have this really cool um, I Hope That You Burn necklace, which is a reference to Hamilton. And then this really cute little bear pin and just a bobby pin for funsies. Then I have these awesome thrifted shoes that you guys would have seen in my um like trying on all my shoes video and i wanted to put them on display because they're absolutely fabulous then i have this little box with bears on it because i just thought that was cute i have some butterflies here which are really fun i don't know i just like them i just put them there and that's like kind of the window well one window then we have this squiggly mirror that I've done some filming in before. It's quite fun. I like it very much. Then we have the wardrobe. It's not very exciting, but I started sticking photos that I took on here and I want to fill like the whole wardrobe. But right now I've only done that portion and you guys would have seen this kind of area in the background of some of my videos because I like to film in front of this. So there's my wardrobe. Then we have my desk. Uh, there's a lot to unpack here because there's like shelves and you know like a lot of stuff. This is where I put like everything on display and it's kind of a bit crazy. So I'm going to start on this side where I have two paintings that I painted and they're not good but I like them so we have them chilling there. Two really messed up candles. Um, this is actually a nightlight because I hate the dark. And I just covered it in this scarf thing because it matches my room and it's too bright. And then I have this weird mirror thing that's actually really bad. It's meant to stick onto the wall. But as you can tell, it's all like disfigured. I don't know. It looks really weird. I'll probably get rid of it. I don't know why it's here. And here, wow. This is a package I'm shipping out for Depop. So just um, ignore that. <laughs> then I have my coat hanger with all of my sunglasses on it and it's getting pretty full but you know it's just hanging there a little picture frame with my uh, primary school friends another mirror with some clips uh, some perfumes another candle and we have Russell from up we love him so much so first shelf is where I kind of put on display like my bags and shoes as you can tell these are my three favorite shoes, so I keep them up here to, you know, display to everyone so everyone can see. Have some purses in the background and then some of my most favorite bags. Love them so much. Then upper level, we have a 
little bunny, which I find super cute with a Polaroid of my friends and I. Got a little camera collection happening up here. I don't even know how this happened. I kind of just did. This is actually meant to be up here, so <laughs> that's better. So camera collection, some more bags that I like. Two little angels that I bought from like a dollar store or something because they're just so cute. I love them. And then I'm gonna try and show you the top shelf, but it's pretty high up. So first we have this weird gummy bear light that doesn't even work, but I thought it was cool. And then a fake Chanel perfume bottle, Chanel number no. five. A little duck piggy bank, smiley face, smiley face, smiley face LED light. Uh, Coca-Cola bottle with actual coke inside. Don't drink it. And then we just have some more items. I'm not going to go through every single one because it's just going to get a bit annoying. Since we're kind of heading in this direction, I'm going to show my clothing rack next. Wow! So, Here's my guitar. I used to take guitar lessons, fun fact, and then I stopped. I still play sometimes, but not really. This is like my Depop storage area. I have some jackets stored on here because they couldn't fit in my wardrobe since I have too many clothes. And then like this half is all Depop stock, um, along with some bags and a little scarf and stuff. So if any of this looks interesting to you, please check out my Depop. Yeah. I also have some bucket hats here. This one's mine, but the others are ones that I customized. For example, here's a carrot bucket hat. I don't know, I just drew that. And there's a few others underneath there. And the piece de la resistance. I actually don't know how to say that. Piece, piece de la resistance. Piece, piece de resistance. It's the main place of my bedroom. <laughs> so this, is the coolest thing in my bedroom, I think. It's this really cool zebra print, print carpet. Have no idea where it's from, but it's super sick. I really like it. I'm glad it's in my room. Over here, we have like a little stool slash shoe rack. But because I have so many shoes, I had to store them on the top too. So it would have been a really cool seat, but unfortunately I have a shoe addiction. So, Got shoes down the bottom, shoes on the side, shoes on the other side, and shoes on the top. Uh, so like three layers of shoes, which is always fun. And sweeping across here, we have a skateboard that I never ride, a penny. And then a banjo -lele, a banjo crossed with a ukulele, which I also never use. So this is kind of like the section of non-used items. And over here is another really cool um, section of my room. It's this bar table thing, I don't know. I put this in my room because I was like, you know what? I've never met anyone with a bar table in their room and I am going to be the first. <laughs> These used to live outside, but I stole one and I sometimes eat my dinner here when like my parents have people over or I just, I don't know, I want to eat my room. So kind of had this really cute little setup here, this is where I film my singing videos. I don't really do them as much anymore, but I sit on this stool, put my camera there and film. So that's really fun. I also have my Hamilton pillow just chilling up here because you know, why not? Along with a friend's poster that I've had for ages. You may notice that the rest of this wall is completely blank. And this is because I have no idea what I'm gonna do with the rest of this wall. So if you have any suggestions, Please leave a comment down below. I'm either thinking doing a heap of Harry Styles or One Direction things up here, or like making a bigger photo collage. Here are some of the posters that I got from France. Um, I think they're really cool. I got them in 2018, and since then my style's kind of changed. I still like them, but I kind of just wish I picked different ones. Um, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna change these or anything, um, but they hang out over here. Um, here is my phone making heaps of noises because apparently I'm getting messages all of a sudden with Harry Styles in the background of course. This is my... Uh,
This is my bed. This is where I sleep every night. For all the stalkers out there who wanted to know. Uh, yes, I sleep in this bed. It is quite comfortable and funky. So, um, I don't really know what else to say about this. I really like the print, but it kind of doesn't match this pillow I have here. Uh, which I also really love, but yeah, it's kind of just a bit... That's what I meant about my room being really mitch, mismatched. There's just all these patterns kind of everywhere. Down the side here is my messy side area with my laptop, all my cords and stuff. We kind of just don't look at that section. We have some more posters that I have from France here, just chilling um, up on the wall. I really like that one. That one's my personal favorite. She's stunning, absolutely killing it. My second little window is chilling up here and here I have this cool little green lantern thing that I got from Ikea. A book called Zoe the Skating Fairy, which I love so much because it like relates to me. If you ever read the Rainbow Magic series when you were younger, you're like so cool and I want to be friends with you. Um, but yeah, this is Zoe the Skating Fairy and she can roller skate, she has red hair, and her name is Zoe. So this book is about me. If you wanna read my biography, there it is. Next to that, we have this cool plant, and usually I'm not much of a plant person, but I got this for my birthday, and it's looking quite majestic as it's growing out. Very cool. Don't really know what type of plant it is. Um, and <laughs> here you can see my phase I went through where I like to paint jars. This was kind of, through quarantine, I painted a few jars because I just got bored. So here's one with a rainbow on it, and here's one with a smiley face on it. Um, I don't know, it's a weird hobby, but I had fun, so. <laughs> the last little section of my bedroom is here. So this is um, on top of my bed. There's a lot of place to display things in my room, I kind of just realized. And I have a lot of things to display because I am a hoarder. <laughs> Not really, I actually love getting rid of stuff. But I like having things on display. I like showing things off. So here's more here's more stuff. So over here I have my little collection of fashion books. As you can see that like two of them are by Megan Hess because I love her. She is amazing. So there's like my little fashion book section. I have some hand sanitizer here because you know Corona, got to keep safe keep hand sanitizer with you at all times you know even though I live in Perth Australia and there have been no cases for many months so we we G over here then here's my little Harry Styles um, appreciation billboard um, I'm planning to cover this whole thing with things to do with Harry Styles but so far I have this really cool Harry Styles Polaroid thing of his 2017 album and then fine line I really like these and then I try to be artsy and cool and make like lyric cards I don't know and display them so I've got I'm falling again I'm falling again I'm falling I'm not gonna sing every single song because that'll take a while and here are my roller skates I'm filming a video you're probably not going to be in it. No, I don't say that anymore. Yeah. Hello, we got. Your, your butt. Props. Did you feel? Oh, baby. Come on, baby. No, I'm sorry. Oh, my gosh. So, I just got a very pleasant visit from my sister and May and I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep that part in the video because I was filming our conversation um, but if I do you'll see that she just abused my dog pretty much what happened is she pulled the stairs away when May was trying to walk down them and May just you know just I don't know how to explain it okay back to the room tour so as I was saying here are my roller skates these are the ones that I use. Those obviously do not fit me. I got these for free and I just wanted to put them on display. But these are my pride and joy, my babies. I love them. 
Over here, I just have a single lonely candle. So sorry, candle, that you're lonely. Then I have this really weird snow globe thing with a polar bear with a crown holding a cat. And it says smelly. And my dad got this for me and I don't know why. Here, I got my greatest shave pin plus a pin that says Dancing Queen, because why not? Got Eric by Sean Tan, because I really like his books. And then over here is the product of me being bored for a day. So I made this bedroom, this like indie weird bedroom that I thought was really cool. Um, so you see there's some clothes on the floor and this weird carpet, plus a wardrobe and a bed and this weird lamp. And a poster that says, you like jazz, Barry B. Benson quote right there. So that is my entire room. After a year of procrastinating and not doing it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this room tour. I really like my room. There's obviously a lot of things that I want to change about it. I want to put some more posters up. I need more colour in here. So you'll see a lot of changes happening because I change my room like every day. But yeah. I cleaned my room especially for this moment. Usually it is very clean just had a moment of weakness and had clothes everywhere. So as you can tell, we are losing light. So I'll make this outro nice and short. Thank you all for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.